the midpoint of a segment. If we have two points A and B and we draw a straight line starting at A and ending at B, we will have a segment. A segment is a straight line that begins with a point and ends with another point. The segment is a straight line with two endpoints. A segment is named by its two endpoints, which are here A and B, so you write AB between two brackets. The two points A and B are the endpoints of this segment, and we can measure the lengths of a segment using a graduated ruler. The midpoint of a segment is the point that divides the segment into two equal segments. We can say that M is a midpoint of segment AB, which means M is equidistant from both A and B. That means it is at an equal distance from A and B. We can find the half of a segment using a graduated ruler. We measure the length of the segment AB and we look for the half of this measurement. For example, segment AB measures 6 cm. To find its midpoint M, first we should find the half of 6. The half of 6 is 3. We make a small dash on the 3 and then we place the midpoint M of segment AB. M is the midpoint of segment AB, so M is equidistant from A and B. For that, we say that MA equals MB equals 3 cm. In geometry, we can identify that MA equals MB by placing a code as a small sign or a line on MA, and the same code on MB. Let's practice some exercises. With the ruler, find the midpoint O of segment CD. First, we measure the length of segment CD. CD equals 5 cm and 4 mm. Before finding the half of segment CD, it is necessary to convert the measurement of this segment in millimeters to facilitate the work. 5 cm, 4 mm equals 54 mm. So the half of 54 mm is 27 mm. And at the end, we place the point O on the middle of segment CD. OC equals OD equals 27 mm. For that, we can now code it by drawing a small dash on OC and the same code on OD.